Yeah, good morning out there, too. It's a nice sunny Saturday morning here in central Indiana. And it's cold. It's cold enough that MLWJ questioned my sanity when I went out for a little ride here. This is a, uh, thought I'd make a little video response today. I've tried to do this three or four times and just haven't put the words together right. That's why uh, I cut one of my last videos off short. It was only about a minute or so. All the talking I did in it didn't make any sense. So I cut out all the talking and that made it too short. And uh, people didn't like it that it was short, so I just took it off. No sense in making up some people upset. Anyway, this is, uh, like I said, this is a video response to Suburban Rider. Four rules, or rather guidelines, of moto vlogging. And then he added a fifth, so it's actually the Suburban Rider 5 guidelines of motorcycle vlogging. And uh, this time I made myself a list, like I saw a very experienced vlogger do many times. I won't mention any names, Suburban Rider. But anyway, here we go. So his rule number one, I, I kind of maybe rephrased some of these a little bit, shorten it down. And I went through his the comments that were made on his video. And also I went through um, maybe Thomas's eight video. Kind of put some of these together. So let's go. Number one, five minutes of music does not a vlog make. I tend to agree with that one. Uh, it's not a vlog. It's a uh, it's just a video. I've got some myself. I've um, got one recently of me and MLWJ out on a fall ride. The scenery is pretty. I really couldn't say anything to explain it, but I thought I'd add some nice fall music to it. It's a pleasant ride. I've had a lot of people comment how nice, how much they liked it. So that's that's fine. It's fine if you do them. Just it's not a vlog. Anyway, number two. The target duration time is seven minutes. That's not bad, unless you're pretty interesting. It's seven minutes, anything above seven minutes, it's uh, going to get kind of boring. Now, granted, if you're windier in the bag of buttholes, and I won't mention any names, if it's on the safe, um, it may take you a little longer to say what you want to say. And that's fine. Well, people can turn it off. Uh, number three, tell us who you are and, and about you, the good and the bad. Um, you know, you kind of do that without even knowing it in your actions and your words. So that's kind of a given. Number four, don't feed the trolls. You know, there's trolls out there in every kind of life, in every, everything we do. And uh, I'll answer that with a BC65925 quote. Ignore the ignorant, admonish the assholes that always perceive the perceptive. You know, the trolls, those are, and they're not, they're the assholes, okay? The ignorance are the ones that just don't know any better. You just ignore them. Maybe enlighten them a little bit, but don't get upset with them. And admonish the assholes, ignore them, um, or feed them, feed them table scraps, kind of like Navy Thomas A. does, make fun of it, that's, that's okay, but perceive the perceptive, okay, uh, this is something a lot of people aren't good at, including me, take the criticism, the, the constructive criticism, as just that, is somebody trying to help you. Uh, can't do nothing but help. You can always ignore it. 
you don't think it's right. But look at it in the light that, hey, this might be good advice. You might learn something from it. Okay. And he added number five later on. He said, include a response. Um, kind of, that's kind of paraphrased. And include a question or a response. Um, it's kind of like this. This is a response to his video. You know, and I put up a video with a question about about whether your significant others uh, question your uh, your mental capacity when you go out for a ride on a day like today. You know, and it gets people thinking, and they go out and vlog, and it makes more traffic on your sub list for you to go watch videos, and it makes fun. 